when we when we have a fixed mindset, we feel that we're not innately good at something. Like, you know, I'm not a technology person. I'm a people person. I'm just not a change person. I'm a, you know, stable times person. From that belief, you know, what happens is we can't change much. There's not much point trying. Feedback is dangerous. Stretch goals are bad here. And other people's success actually makes us feel worse. So you know, if we feel we're innately not a good cook, for example, a good cook comes along and, you know, cooks in our house, we actually shrink back and cook even less in future. So a fixed mindset is this, is, is this belief that we're not innately good at something, whereas a growth mindset is this belief that we can get better. We can change. You know, we have to try and we need feedback and we need stretch goals and we need to learn from other people. But what's really, really interesting about this mindset concept is how prevalent it is and how much people can actually switch from one to the other quite simply. So we've been studying this uh, across the literature and across organizations, and it's quite simple to shift from fixed to growth. Now, here's the basic concept, you know, in a fixed mindset, you're trying to look good, you know, prove that you're good in a growth mindset. You just, you don't care about how you look. You're just trying to improve yourself, right? You just, you're just fascinated by getting better. You see how relevant that is to this time? Organizations need to be obsessed by not trying to get it perfect, but just by getting better, particular in particular with service transformation. Now, here's the really interesting news. We've taught this to hundreds and hundreds of thousands of people. <coughs> Excuse me. We have data showing that over 90% of people, when you teach this, actually every week they shift at least one thing from fixed to growth mindset. And about a quarter of people literally every day shift from a fixed to a growth mindset. And one of the ways they do that is literally adding one word. It's an incredibly simple word. It's when you notice yourself saying, hey, I'm just not good at this, you know, technology stuff, or I'm not good at this working from home stuff, or I'm no good at this hybrid working, or I'm no good at all this change, or I'm just not a digital person. You add one word and that word is yet. I'm just not good at this, you know, digital transformation yet. I'm just not good at all this, you know, this hybrid work yet. And adding this one word, it's not the only way you create growth minds, but adding this one word is the simplest way, the fastest way. What you'll see as you start doing this is that it's actually transformational. And in studies, we've seen it literally changes how you process the world in the brain. So this is an incredibly important, very measurable habit that you can put into your organization.